After taking the relatively drastic action at the start of this year of imposing a negative interest rate on some reserves being held by Japanese banks as a way of trying to force them to pump money back into the economy, all eyes have been on the Central Bank of Japan to see what action they might take this time. The answer is nothing dramatic. It's merely a tweaking of current policy. But this meeting has been more about a review of the so-called Arbonomics, the strategy by the Prime Minister Shinzo Abe to rejuvenate the economy. As such, the verdict seems to be it is a policy that is working, if only just. The focus of uh, this policy session was a review of policies of the last three years, and the Bank of Japan has to be positive on it. But there was enormous pressure also to come up with some new tools, with a forward-looking guidance in terms of, well, we are still in the market, we are supporting the market, Abenomics is working, and we will remain expansionary, and the Bank of Japan has delivered just that. The truth is, after more than three years and billions of yen being pumped into the economy, it's difficult at times to see signs of that rejuvenation. After early success, the economic growth rate has fallen back again. And once more, we have a strong yen, which makes it difficult for companies in this export-oriented economy. Millions of jobs have been created, but wages remain stagnant. So even if there is money around, people seem reluctant to spend it in these gloomy days.